This episode of Tasty Taipei brings me to the top one pot restaurant. Hey, hey! Hey! Megan, you know what? What? Eating hot pot has become a national pastime fit for any season here in Taiwan. Well, you know what I heard? That Taiwan is the number one destination for hot pot. Yeah, and mm -hmm. you know what? We have more than 4,000 to 5,000 hot pot establishments around Taiwan. Way more than any other wow, restaurant. Four to 5,000. I'd say that's a lot of hot pot. And among them, I've chosen a very special one for you behind nice. us. Wow. Once we go in, we'll have to go through a transformation. Well, let's transform ourselves. <laughs> let's, go. let's go! Look at you! Look at you! <laughs> all right, all right. But tell me again why we are dressed like this. Well, because we are here for the hot pot and they have the basis from the recipe of the ancient royal family. Wow, all so right. So you get to dress like an empress. Wow. Look at you! For me, I am the eunuch. Well, why did you choose this outfit? I mean, that was your... I mean, aren't you happy to serve me? Well, yeah, I'm happy. I can be your servant today, <laughs> all right? Thank you, I can live with that role. The Top One Pot restaurant has clinched the number one spot for spicy hot pot in an online survey. The restaurant serves many different kinds of hot pot sets, including royal spicy hot pot, chicken pot, pickled cabbage pot, and duo sets. It also has private rooms named after palaces built during the Qing Dynasty. Tell me why pot pot is so popular among the Taiwanese people. Okay, it's so important because of the idea of getting together. You know, the warm hot pot reminds people of family gatherings during Lunar New Year, mm -hmm. where a lot of important family events, people will sit down and share the hot pot together. Okay, so it's very communal and very social. Yes, and right now it's the two of us. Yes. But it's okay. It's okay. Because we'll make it interesting. Yes. That's because we're gonna have another food challenge for you. Oh, no. <laughs> Food challenge. Okay. Spice acceptance level. So today we have three draws for you. Here we go. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> it is big, oh spicy, super no. spicy. No. Yay! No, 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 no. You, you tricked me. No, I That's believe the, you are the, tricking your empress. Ball. You are disobeying your empress. Okay, I'll have <laughs> another one. And that is. Super oh, spicy! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no. Anyway, yeah, all right. you're just gonna the try Empress, it tonight. The Empress requests to bring on the super spicy hot pot challenge. We order the duo pot with chicken, then we add our own ingredients. Meatballs, pork neck slices, tofu sheets, a lobster boat, and so-called beef from heaven. You have to try it, so I'll try to scald it for you. Three, four, Five, six, seven. Then so you're seven done. Seven is the lucky number. Yes, that's a way of eating it, and that's for you. And you eat it. It's too hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You, hate, you as my eunuch, I, 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 I order you to try the first bite. Now be my honor. <laughs> okay. <sighs> it smells so nice. Eat. All these like herbs. Mmm, he's in heaven. I'm in the heaven. You know the tenderness of the beef. It's the one that you can never imagine. Well, I'll My take majesty. your word for it. All right, there here you we go. go. Junik, look at those birds over there. What's that? Well, That's too late. <laughs> Let me help you. Oh, I'm burning my hand. How's it? The Empress is quite pleased. It's delicious. Uh -huh. It's very tender. Um, easy to chew. You only I chewed maybe three times before I swallowed. Yeah. It's amazing. It's so thin. It's not too hot. Yeah. Uh, oh, at the same time. I went on the other side. <laughs> well, duh. Oh, sorry. My Empress. You make you are not supposed to be in front of your Empress. Okay. So after that, be from heaven. You still be have a lot heaven. of ingredients here, eh? 
the food here looks almost too good to eat. Beautiful. They're for you. Amazing. Yeah, Roses. they match you. They match me, thank you. <laughs> Roses out of, what is that? Pork. Roses out of pork. And wow, it's the amazing. meat, the pork, from uh, pork neck. Pork, pork neck. neck. Yeah, so it also you can expect it to be very tender. But the it's way too you beautiful it, to tear apart. See, that's what I, I'm going to tell you. You just have to put the whole <laughs> rolls into the broth. Here we go. Seven times? No, you just put oh. it in and let it cook. <laughs> okay. Well, before we, be, before we continue, I just need to get a little bit more of a history lesson. That's all right. Um, so the, the Empress is eating food from which dynasty? Well, um, actually from our outfit, it's Qing Dynasty. The Qing Dynasty. Yeah, which is from the 17th century and right. it lasts long to the 20th century, the early 20th century. Okay. Since you have the Chinese community, you have the hot pot. You have pot. the hot pot. Everywhere you go around the world, no matter in Singapore, Malaysia, mainland China definitely, so many different places with Chinese communities. People enjoy hot and pot. What are the typical spices again for each time? Well, every time you'll get the same type of hot pot, they use the same spices? No, there are so many varieties. Some hot pot, they're not spicy. We have small ones, big ones, mm -hmm. spicy ones, salty ones, okay. and sour ones. No sweet ones. <laughs> no, that's fondue. You're talking about fondue. Well, the lobster boat is the seafood deluxe set. Look how lustrous it is. It is. This is gorgeous. This, this the is the shrimp food. Yes, it's a shrimp. Exactly. It's a lobster boat. A lobster boat. Okay, the captain. The captain is, is a lobster. So you know. have the lobster here, mm -hmm. and then you have shrimp, also um, clam, a tilapia, tilapia fillets, salmon fillets. A scallop and squid. And squid. How rich is what it? What a feast! This is a this is gorgeous. Look yeah. at that. So, this, but this to me seems very special, uh, as if it would be eaten on holidays, mostly. But um, this is more than just common common dish. Well, I won't say like everything here is common. Like for the lobster, of course, exactly. we order it for you. My empress, but normally, but normally we'll have shrimps and fish. It's very common here: squid, right. scallop. The sheets are made of very thin tofu, and the ink comes from the sea. Do you know Chinese calligraphy? Oh, of course. Of course, and here you have it's called a thousand layers of tofu skin. Do we eat it? Yeah, we eat it, we cook it. But before that, you have to draw something for us. Are you serious? Yes! I was joking. For the cuttlefish sauce. We're gonna eat that? You know, in the past... That's ink. <laughs> no, that's not ink. That's from the cuttlefish. <laughs> so it's not only delicious, but it's also very fun. <laughs> What's that? Is that a roof or mountain? Oh... Is it a... <laughs> this on... is a Taiwanese poodle. What? <laughs> <laughs> this is the dog. These are the dogs I see on the street here. <laughs> okay. But we'll right. cook it, okay? All right, well, let's cook it. Get rid of it. <laughs> oh, no, we're eating dog. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. And you, you want to eat your drawing? No. <laughs> no, I want my drawing. I want... I would like to do my drawing again. It's here. See, okay, with I, I cuttlefish sauce. Cuttlefish sauce. Is it going to get all over my... No, okay. Just, just a... Ooh. Oh, the pot. <laughs> Thank you. I wasn't in my impress. The Empress did not enjoy that experience just now. Too hot. See, <laughs> that's, that's what I find very interesting. But Here in Taiwan, we can eat food when it's really hot. Yeah, you, because you change your tongues for these spices and the spicy and the temperature. Probably, but when I um, take my foreign friends to hot pot places like this, they always have to wait for a long time. Yes, of course, otherwise wait you the... burn your tongue. I just, I think I burn my tongue. You, you have to wait for the food to cool down. Now. I burned the Empress's tongue. <laughs> I'm sorry. So what's my punishment? 
since you claim that you can eat such spicy, spicy food, I challenge you to eat this. It's not in the script. <laughs> so what? <laughs> you know what? Sometimes it looks spicy, but it's not really spicy because the broth already absorbed all its essence. Okay. So. Are you scared? You're not no, gonna do I'm it. No, I'm not scared. No, I'm from Taiwan. <laughs> really spicy. <laughs> Did I do it? No. No. You don't do it. Okay. Oh. Water. <laughs> I'll help myself. <laughs> Unique is my good unit. Oh. It's spicy, but you know, in Taiwan we'll say shuang. Shuang means even though it's so spicy, but you enjoy it so much. Going for You're it. Like, I'm really impressed. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I like it. My tongue is burning. My <laughs> lips are burning. <laughs> so oh. You're you're a champ. You're a real champ. You're a real sport. Yeah. yeah. My tasty diary. Hot pot reflections. A feast for the eyes. A celebration for the senses. A meal fit for a king, or in my case, an empress. No wonder this sets the standard for Taiwanese cuisine.